So yesterday the weatherman said the question about when is winter going to start in Maine will be answered this weekend. So here we are. It is nine degrees. We got some snow, but they say we're going to get something like three to eight inches on Monday. So winter is about to begin. All of y'all that's been saying, oh, when are you going to do snowplow videos? Well, pretty soon, I tell you. So it's kind of a Christmas tree light exploration recently. Um, it started out with me, you know, I put solar lights in the headlights of the ugly stepsister, which I'm very happy about. And I wanted some security lights around the house, so I found these online, and uh, they weren't very expensive. So I decided, well, they don't use any electricity. I don't need a timer for them. I can put them up on the side of the house and forget about them, and they'll be up and working, and they'll be good to go. So then I stumbled across on Amazon some of these solar Christmas lights. And... I mean, what could be better than that? You know how with a Christmas light, you have to run a, a cord out in the yard in the snow, and then you have to either plug it in or put it on a timer. Well, these you just put up on the house. When it gets dark, they come on, and they go off. Some of them even sparkle and flash like that one's doing. This one has got little gold wire things on it. Um, and this one here, similar, little silver wire things, and... This one here, oh, it's got little blue lights. What do we got over here? This is like a cord band thing with lights in it. I was originally thinking about doing the 55 Ford. I was gonna do the bottom part blue and the top part white and take that gold and do it down the chrome strip. But then it occurred to me that after we get eight inches of snow, nobody would ever see it anyway. So I'm kind of thinking, oh, I probably won't do that. But I'm gonna do something with these lights this weekend. I'm gonna put them up around here in various places. I thought about putting them, I was thinking about this morning, I came out to the back door and I looked out there and the first thing I see is that little building. And I thought, well that little building would look kind of pretty if it had some Christmas lights on it, you know? Something that I would see when I look out the back. And of course I got that big shed over there. I, I got these uh, icicles, I see blue ones here, to uh, my thinking on them is that I would put them uh, on the front of the house. I don't know why they went off when I walked over there. Put them back on. I guess they're doing their little sparkly thing. So we're going to play with some lights. Of course, like I said earlier, it's nine degrees outside. I ain't real anxious about getting out there yet. Imagine that. Hmm. I might also, you know, I keep a little light bulb burning in that lantern there. A little red light that you can see. If you can see it out there. But it might look nice to put some little lights along the edge of that building. Kind of decorate it up too. Ho, oh, ho the joy. Ho, ho, ho the joy. Ho, ho, ho the joy. Ho, 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 ho the joy. Alrighty then, it's gotten up to 12 degrees today. It's like a heat wave burning in my heart. I can't keep from crying. <laughs> it's tearing me apart. That's not true, uh, but it is cold, really cold, cold enough to be, well, I got four shirts on, I just, and a vest, and a coat, and a coat, and I got all of my solar lightage out here charging up in the sunshine. By the way, I heard a fake news story on Facebook the other day where they said that all these people with all these solar lights are draining the energy out of the sun so that within 50 years the sun would go dark because we would have used it all up. I know that's a great concern of all of y'all thinking people, so... I'm just saying. Uh, just I'll see how much gas I got left in the gas tank here, just in case I want to fire off my rockets. Let me put y'all on hold.